We're playing uh, Vampire Survivors, which it, it comes recommended uh, secondhand through a YouTuber named Splattercat. I saw him on uh, Twitter being like, hey, check out this game. And then I looked at it and I was like, look, it looks like it's from the Super Nintendo, which I don't hold a grudge. Look at the games that I play, but I'm like, you know, some games you look at it, oh, the first, everyone remembers where they were the first time they looked at Among Us. They immediately got it. They were like, so elegant. Look at this guy. He's sus. But Vampire Survivors, I had to get a little bit more convinced, but here I am looking forward to it. Many people in my chat were saying, oh, I played this for five hours yesterday. I played this for, you know, 10 hours this weekend. Let's give it a try. The way I, I bought it on Steam, by the way, it's $3. The way I understand it, it's like a roguelite, kind of. Um, you play as like one insanely strong individual creature that mows down hordes and hordes of uh, mobs. That's the way I understand. Yeah, it's a bullet hell, but you're the one dispensing the bullets. It's also kind of similar, uh, it's been said, to Snake RX. Let's just give it a try, man. I'll be Antonio. He, his attacks deal 10% more damage every 10 levels to a maximum of 50%. Okay. I'm moving. So, he, is he auto, he's auto-attacking. What can I doubt on? Well, we don't know yet. Kill some bats, collect some gems. The gems allow us to get experience. Look at that, get owned. He's schmoovin' already. Whoa, oh my god, okay. I'm gonna turn down the volume just ever so slightly. <laughs> Scare me a little bit. Shoulders come down. Get those shoulders down, there you go. Okay. Knife. Fires quickly in the face direction. Santa water. Generates damaging zones. Axe. High damage, high area scaling. We gotta try some Santa water, man. Oh, look at that! So I think it's... I, I think this is one of those games, from what I've seen in, like, the screenshots, this is one of those games where, like, you scale out of control. I don't think it's one of those games, like... You know, like Slay the Spire, where you get like, you know, a little better over time. It's one of those games like Monster Train, where, you know, you go to the stratosphere. Uh, you scale exponentially, let's say, instead of linearly. Shields from damage when active. High damage, high area scaling, or King Bible. I mean, come on, we gotta go King Bible. Orbits around the player. Look, there it is. It do be orbiting. You're not wrong. It, it wouldn't be the worst thing to get, like, some kind of diagonal weapon. I would agree. Okay, I see that we got some stronger enemies that have appeared now. Help me. Do you have HP? They, they would... With a game like this, you can't make it if you get hit once you die. Like, that's... That's not conceivable. This is the new Isaac. Hey, put some respect on Isaac's name, okay? I'm, and, you know, you don't have to take respect off of Vampire Survivors. I'm just saying. Isaac's been somewhat kind to me lately. It's, I'm, I'm, I'm a noted Isaac enjoyer yet again. You know what? Let's get a level 2 whip. Fires one more projectile. Whoa, whoa. Th there you go. We got a front end bag now. the heck is that dad's briefcase okay toss me an axe treasure found i saw an animation of this and i'm like this is what it's all about this is the dopamine i saw someone click on the chest and it just exploded in a fountain of loot oh oh it's it's the csgo slot machine oh 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 santa water level two Okay. Level 2 Santa water. I mean, this seems pretty good, don't get me wrong. Oh yeah, I guess, uh, obviously I have HP, huh? Probably, uh, indicated by the red bar underneath my, uh, character. 
Help me. Help me. Help me. Did you see the... What the heck, man? Do you see the horde? Okay, some enemies are meant to be killed. Some enemies are meant to be dodged. <laughs> help, 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 help. That's a good bit. He's just an Isaac boy just trying to make it. You know what? For now, why don't you give me a level 2 axe? Let's let's keep it moving. Let, let's scale upwards instead of outwards. I, I some protection from damage maybe would be nice when the when the bat swarms arrive. When you destroy torches, they can also drop food to heal. Great intel. Thank you. Thank you. I gotta be honest, real VIP right now, King Bible. King Bible is doing some fantastic work at keeping me safe. What in the Castlevania 2 Simon's Quest am I looking at? It's a very Dan Giesling type comment. I respect it. I gotta be honest, I so I, I touch base with Dan, you know, at least like once a week. Talk about, you know, how how things are going at home, how the how the stream's going. And he was like, how how the stream's been going lately? And I was like, oh, the, the French Canadian car game I played was was a lot of fun. Super people kinda uh <laughs> a little resident sleeper, but you know. But I was confiding in him that to be honest with you, yeah, it's level three Santa water. I was confiding in him that watching uh, a little bit of his Nuzlocke runs has made me much more open to the idea of doing one myself. The only thing holding me back is that I think that I didn't realize at first the clip ability, like the the pog generation you can get from the most poggy moments in the in the run. But I, I recognize, because I've played, you know, enough Pokemon in the past, the moment-to-moment -moment actual gameplay can be, if you'll forgive the terminology, can be a little tedious. But I think we, we maybe we can find a way. I'm going to level with you. I'm going King Bible. Two King Bibles? I, I think I'm, I'm like, I'm specking into King Bible here. Good for banter, though. Probably true. Probably true. So what... Okay, so the timer at the top is how long we survived. The skulls are how many uh, baddies we've killed, unless we're the baddie. No, probably not. They're skeletons holding javelins. That's like video game language for they're the bad guy. Oh! <laughs> Open. Oh, baby. They did a great job with the King Bible level three, level four, level three. They did a great job with that. The Santa water, sorry, Santa water, level four. Oh! Give me more King Bible, man. I'm all in. That's not a Bible. Sorry, I had the wrong religious figure. I, I got the Bible confused with Santa Claus. Okay, being able to walk through your own... Santa water. That's a good piece of intel. That's going to help out my positioning. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Do I ever have to escape from the bounds of this? I don't know. I don't know. Hey, they're closing in on me. They're moving in. Then now it's, they got BRs in this game now. What the heck? Okay, I got to admit. Looks kind of sick. Or it is kind of sick to play. Oh, they're all dead. At first, I, I feel like this maybe is one of those games where just watching like 10 seconds of it in the Steam store page doesn't, doesn't give you all the sauce. With T edits, this is why you're, you're one of the goats in this industry. All caps. They turned Loop Hero into Gungeon and then like three question marks at the end and then you're just your face like so good you know i think we need some more raw damage personally we got a lot more space well we got two more spaces for equipment should we desire it snake rx but castlevania um genshin impact meets castlevania 
This is kind of like Genshin, right? Isn't Genshin, you just sort of like move around and your phone does the attacking for you? I'm not trying to be a hater. Like, that's my understanding. It is kind of like that. That's what I thought, because, I mean, you're on a phone, you know? It's not... You're not on, like, a flight stick, you know? There's only so much complexity that they can introduce. I'm not a hater. I play Super Auto Pets. Okay, you know what this is? This is like when you're at the mall and you're trying to get into a store, but, like, people are... You, you've got slow walkers surrounding you absolutely everywhere, so you have to use your sh movement to cause them to create an opening at the Lululemon front door so that you can get in. So people be walking up, just looking in the window, not using the oh, provided hand sanitizer. Good stuff, good stuff. The sh movement is insane. Dude, we need to get some XP though. I'm, I'm, I don't think I'm scaling as fast as the hordes. Hey, don't, don't hate on the Lululemon. Um, I'll have you know I'm wearing a pair of their pants right now. Someone in Kate's chat, I, I apologize, your name escapes me right now. Kate was talking about how I always blow out the crotches on my jeans. And someone said, you should try the ABC pants from Lululemon. They're stitched different, like they're not stitched like across. They create, uh, across the groin, they create like a little pocket. What the heck, Mantis Lord. Um, I need some XP. So I, I, I got some. And I gotta tell you, they're very comfortable. If you didn't hear Isaac today, which is probably true, they, they feel kind of like a men's dress pant, which is always comfortable. It's the most comfortable part of the, of the men's business formal attire. But then they got kind of like more like a jean waistband that stretches a little bit. It's nice. They are, they are expensive. There's, there's no doubt about that. But it would also, oh, get to the chest, get to the chest. Okay, save me, save me, save me. I will also say, you know, look, 130 bucks is an expensive pair of pants, but I've been buying like, you know, $40 pairs of pants from H&M and blowing the crotch out in like three months. So if they, if they break 400% slower than the H&M pants, then it's, then it's money well spent. But I honestly think they might. Because H&M is like, you know, it's designed to break. What the heck? It's a triple chest! Oh my god. Golden whip and two Santa waters. Look at that. Did I have to choose? Did I choose? I hope I didn't choose. I wanted them all. I'm gonna die. But you break the torches. There could be ah! <laughs> If you break the torches, there could be HP inside. Just go, man. Just go. I want it. I want it. I can't get it. Get to a torch. Get to a torch. We'll go back. That's just a freaking coin, man. That's nothing. It's useless to me. That's HP! That's a big red bag! <laughs> With a dollar sign on it. <laughs> okay, okay. Well, I think we, that was 10 minutes. We learned something. We got four unlocks. Survive for under 10 minutes, but close. Okay. Start me again. I totally get it. That's, that's an easy game to get. Oh, you can... Okay, so it's got some rogue legacy as well. Okay. I like that these are expensive, maybe, so you don't scale up super quickly. But I would raise movement speed 5% faster per rank. That seems goaded. So does Magnet as well. Okay, start me. We, don't, we have not gotten... Oh, we, 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 10, 10 gold? That's it. Amelda Belpaze. The heck? She's got a lightsaber? Wow, the characters are so cheap. 
Oh, okay. She shoots a, a homing ball. How about that? Okay, let's get this early experience this time. Look, I it would be irresponsible of me to run the casino right now because I don't know where we're going. You know, I, I don't know what a reasonable survival rate is. We've only had one run, man. It's like going to your first day of school and being like, I got this. Give me, um... Give me King Bible again. Just, I, it was my favorite of the available. Lovely. Okay, dude, you gotta stay a little close to the sauce here. I think she gets more experience per rank is what it said. So, you know, picking up these can't hurt you. Whoa, hey, you. <laughs> it's totally my fault, but magic wand fires one more projectile. Okay. I didn't think it would fire it at the same individual, but you know what? I, okay, I see a little turkey over there, but I'm going to leave it. I'm going to leave it. We don't need it yet. Dude, honestly, Amelda's kind of, she's kind of pog. You ever meet anybody IRL called Amelda? Not like a celebrity, but like a, a real human being. My aunts? Seems like kind of an ant name. I know I'm not the first person to make this joke, but it's really interesting to think about how the names that we associate with like only old people have them now. At one point, young people had them. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> like, yeah, like at one point, there were a bunch of like teenage Ednas running around. And a bunch of like, you know, uh, like 22 year old Richards and stuff like that. Now they're all in their 70s, man. I'm gonna get, let's get Laurel, man. Richard isn't an old person's name. I'm just, I'm not trying to be a hater. I'm just saying like, I don't know the last time I encountered a Richard that was younger than I was. Let's put it that way. Ryan might be there. Dude, I don't, I don't have any control over my own. Well, I guess I have complete control over my own name, but I'm relatively content with mine. I don't really, I mean, honestly, if they stopped naming people Ryan, I'd be happy. They broke the mold. Oh, you see the mythic? What? <laughs> Holy crap! A, a quintuple chest? Do we choose? Oh no, it just did, you get them all. Holy cow. Oh, <laughs> Let's take some armor too. Dude, honestly, I feel like the bat horde is about to get owned. Look at the experience we're generating off of this horde. Dude, give me King Bible! Okay, no King Bible. That's fine. That's fine. We're hanging tough. Okay, I did take a little damage. You know what? Let, give me give me more invulnerability. I feel like we got something going here. I need that XP. We got to do some shmovement. Okay, shmove me. Shmove me. Right, look at that! Right into the mother load! What do you do with the coins? They are used for uh, passive unlocks outside of battle that give you a permanent increase in your power level inside of battle. I mean, this seems insane. Why don't you just give me 7% more experience? 7% is... that's a large number. Doubles in 10 years, so true. Based rule of 72 enjoyer is in the chat. The rule of 72 enjoyer has logged on. Yes. 7% on top of 7%, holy cow. We're already two years into our rule of 72. Should have gotten 10% move speed. 
You know how many percentage move speeds we're going to be able to get with all this compounding experience? You're going to drop a chest, you piece. Yeah, yeah, you're an elite. Get ready to drop the chest. Oh, baby. Character moves 10% faster. What the heck? We're getting such better perks this time. I knew it. Oh, give me. I'm not going to be able to even get my heart rate up unless I see at least three items come out of here. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Uh, two crowns and a magic wand? Two crowns seems kind of insane. Can we mouse over to see how we're how we're pogging? How we're schmoving? No, we can't. Okay. Maybe we can pause and see. More cool... Uh, more uh, invulnerability, please. You're gonna need some more damage at some point? I, I believe that. I'm getting... This is StarCraft. I'm getting my Vespian gas economy under control. I'm deploying my SCVs to build refineries. And then we're gonna start getting the fire bats going. Like, you know what? Give me a 10% spinach gain. APM off the charts. This is like... It's, it's like StarCraft if... It was boomer friendly because I, I only need to have one hand on the keyboard, which is not how I meant for that to come across. But you know what? Give me even more movement speed. I want to be schmoving, man. Compare four minutes into this run to four minutes into the last run. Like we're, we're in control right now. All right, fine. Look at this. Welcome. What does schmoving mean? It's it's supposed to be sus movement. Give me one additional charge. But in this case, schmoving is like I I think of schmoving all the time when I'm in like a crowded place. Schmoving is we you've got some place to be and everybody else is just out for a morning stroll. You know, you know that you got to squeeze by these people. Oh, these people are, you know, looky lose. They're probably going to, you know, stop for, uh, you know, window shopping. So you're going to squeeze by them on the left and then you're going to pivot right back in on the right. And it's all going to be good to go, you know. It's schmoving is moving with intent. It could be smooth, it could be it could be saucy, it could be anything. Sure, you know what? Base damage up by 10. Happens often in grocery stores. So true. I can't believe that even grocery stores have window shoppers, man. People will stop and like look at the mangoes and be like, nah. Crop doesn't look so good today. I sleep. I sleep. Boo. Single magic wand. Pa oh, but it's piercing! Ooh! Never mind. That's not so bad. Holy cow. I'm scared. The enemies are getting a little stronger. But you know what? We're very quick. Just kite them. Make sure you get that experience. It's going to be valuable. L Dude, the hit marker sound is so good, too. Ticka, 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 ticka. Ticka, 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 ticka. Do you go down every single aisle in the grocery store? Um, look, I'm not trying to put you on blast. The answer is absolutely not. But I also grocery shop, I would say, substantially more frequently than the average individual. If I grocery shop like once a week, I, I might go down every aisle. It's possible you might you might need something from every aisle. I grocery shop probably like four times a week. I go down like like five aisles max per trip. I pick up like uh, some kind of protein. I pick up a few fruits and vegetables. I go down maybe maybe baby aisle to get some juices for the baby. Uh, I still want more invulnerability. 
I, w I go down uh, the dairy aisle to get some skier, to get some single serving cheeses, and then I'm out. Before they even knew I was in, I'm out. Okay, there is, there is a chest bat there, you're not wrong. I'm just trying to keep myself in a position of relative safety. Get, get some great vectors here for piercing shots. Steal some XP. Have you ever drank any of the baby juice out of curiosity? I have. Not the breast milk. A lot of people have asked. A lot of people wilding out on this website. But I have, like the baby juice, it's literally just fruits and vegetables. So I thought, oh, I'll give it a try. Then I had one that was like, you know, kale, spinach, and beets. And it tasted like drinking like a melted penny. And I was like, maybe it's better for the baby than for me. People be like, I would try the breast milk. Yeah, okay. You don't even eat like uh, spinach. You're going to drink human breast milk? I'd be surprised. You, you, you spend half of every day on the internet being mad about pineapple on pizza. And you're going to drink human milk? Sure, okay, sure, yeah, totally. I bet. Okay, we're going to beat our PB. That's not even close. That's not even up for debate. Uh, isolated champion? They're too strong. They're too strong. I, I gotta take a new approach. We love to see that. Okay, the, the two champions? These guys are pretty strong, man. We gotta, we gotta get that XP. We've been woefully inadequate in the XP department, but look at all the XP we left for ourselves. Oh! -ho! Triple champion? The fields of rupees. Nice try. Nice try. Nice try. I think we're going to need some more damage. Been a little low on the damage front, having a hard time killing enemies. This is what eight consecutive Laurel upgrades does to a man. Look, you're probably not wrong. I'm scared. But we got, we got the power of... Plus 10% movement speed compounded twice on our side. That's fine. This is why we have Laurel upgrades. There's a way out. There's a way out. You just gotta you just gotta cycle. I think that the 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 flowers take damage collectively, right? Or do they just all disappear when you reach a certain point? Oh no. We out. <laughs> you can just walk through it? I didn't realize. Okay. Another level, get a damage upgrade. We know we got champions around. This might take us to level 20. Oh no. Clear up clear a path? <laughs> um, you know what? Let's let's add a knife to the squad. Let, let's get some extra weaponry going on here, dude. Honestly, this game's kind of sick. You see the size of that mantis? It is also three dollars, which I mean, we're pretty quickly approaching the point, at least in North America, where like. Three dollars is like you can't buy anything with three dollars, man. You could buy like a three cans of soda from a vending machine. I'll take base damage up by ten. My eyes. <laughs> I don't know, like my I do feel like maybe the bit rate's gonna suffer a little bit. How much does a can of soda cost in a vending machine? Like I would, I don't use a vending machine too often. I would think I could get a a bottle of Coke Zero for two fifty Canadian. A can, I would think. I mean, if I if I paid more than two bucks for the can at a vending machine, I would feel ripped off. But 
Yes, more damage, please. Okay, we gotta start moving up at some point, because we're killing enemies up there, but not actually getting their experience. There's werewolves now, by the way. Oh, so there's werewolves now. Great. Okay, get the XP that we left behind. We still got these champions following us. This, oh, don't stop till you're numb. The sh movement is out of control. No, I don't think it despawns. It seems to hang about. Let's go. Okay, we could use a big one. One blue. I sleep. Come on. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. What a rip, man. <laughs> Fires one more projectile. You see those two, like, golden lines tease me? I thought for sure we were getting at least two more. Oh, the hordes are ghosts now. Great. Ghost hordes, werewolves, skeletons with javelins. Am I missing anything? Uh, don't forget about the mantises. Help me. It's all right. This is why you take movement speed, so you can schmoove like this. Oh, this is like trying to squeeze through Barard Station at rush hour. Excuse me, pardon me. Excuse me, pardon me. Now we're gonna now we're gonna create our loop. Excuse me, excuse me. Okay, there you go. We opened up a little line. <laughs> Just put me back down and start. Whoa! There's so many enemies, even the enemies are bumping into each other. XP me, please. Thank you, thank you. That's a juicy deposit. Oh, red one. More damage, please. More damage. I'm taking some... Oh, more damage, thank you. I... I what? We don't need armor yet. Give, give me... Increase my luck. Increase your luck. Oh, I, there's probably something I see. I thought this was a fourth option for... We could forego it to get a better chance of getting more in the future, but it's probably another stat that we haven't seen yet. Let's take, um... Let's take an axe here. Let's get some more project... We got it. I like the axe, because if it misses something on the way up, it hits something on the way down, and we've been moving a lot of up and a lot of down. We are cruising, man. Honestly, movement speed seems okay right now. I think we need to keep eating our spinach. There's a chest. There's a chest with our name on it. There's two chests with our names on them. Squeeze. Just gonna, just gonna squeeze right by you. Help me. Dude, I I know I keep, like, you. some might say I'm overusing this metaphor. This game is so much like walking in a crowded train station. I think that's why I'm a little cracked. Uh-oh. <laughs> Get out of here! Oh, man, my HP. That's no good. Let me out, let me out. Okay, this is a genuine problem. They're closing in on me! I'm just trying to get in before the doors close! No! <laughs> oh, oh, man, okay. Okay, 15 minutes. Five unlocks. I'll tell you what we need what we need from the power up the magnet pickup range plus 25% per rank oh we're going to growth can we oh we can't pay for experience yeah that's crazy man 197 
This will just buy a new character. Pasqualina. Projectiles get faster every five levels to a maximum of plus 30%. Okay. Okay. Oh, dude, dude look at this. Two double stages. What the heck? And oh, we got to give it a try, right? Whoa! Am I insane, or do these all look like uh, angry Wojak? I might just be a little twisted. Let's get a fire wand that deals heavy damage. Like, to me, this kind of looks like Angry Wojak. It's like, no, you can't just make your game 500 hours. Let's also take a... Oh, dude, we need the whip. That was what was holding us back last time. Whip me, whip me. Green gem on the table. Very true, very true. You could probably break the candlesticks, I'm assuming. Pichon bombards in a circling zone. Sure, why not? All right, I see the Sneaker X comparison. I see you. It's bird poop. Sneaker X. Sneaker X, good game, man. Great great game. Just got a little a little hard. <laughs> I thought that's about it. Look, we're crushing it. Give me a crown. If you're crushing it, you get a crown so that you level up faster. Oh baby. This map's a lot tighter, man. You gotta you gotta use and abuse the corners. And then you oh! What was your favorite game as a kid? Easy. All-Star Baseball 1998 with Larry Walker on the N64 cartridge. Colorado Rockies legend. Rune Tracer. Base damage up by 5. Base speed up by 20%? Oh, the Rune Tracer was our default weapon. So now those, those projectiles be moving Duh? What do you mean, duh? I don't know what the hell a rune tracer is. I've never read the Silmarillion. Hit me with a duh. This is just ignorant. Look at that. Rune tracer legit actually sounds like a piece of middleware now. It's like something you use to like save session data in Google Chrome in a highly compressed format. Okay, this is easy. We definitely want 10% damage. Doubles in seven iterations. Look at... Oh, 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 oh man. Oh, man. Maybe one level of Laurel in the future. Sure, maybe one level of Laurel. I think we did not need five levels of Laurel. It, it inhibited us overall. I mean, we're, we're going straight into the Rune Tracer. Oh, baby. It's a feeding frenzy. You're really messing up those Brussels sprouts? How'd you know I botched dinner last night? That's a joke. I didn't botch. It was actually delicious. I'm telling. I'm not the greatest cook in the world. I think I'm okay. All right, but I would honestly put my Brussels sprouts up there against almost any restaurant. Some people out there still serving like uh, you know roasted Brussels sprouts. Sad. All base damage up by 10%. Thank you. What do you put on them? It's not... Look, a little lemon juice, salt, pepper, maybe a little 
microplaned Parmesan. Maybe a little cracked uh, red pepper flakes for a little bit of spiciness. But the trick is not in the in the seasoning. I want the rune tracer, man. The trick is in the the cooking process. Instead of roasting that shit for 20 minutes and making your whole house smell like a fart, you heat up your your pan real hot with an oil that has a high smoke point. Cut the Brussels sprouts in half. Put them cut side down for like four minutes. Flip them over. They're gonna be like close to being charred. That's what you're looking for. Let them go on the other side for four more minutes. Take them out. Add the add the seasoning while they're still hot. That's the secret. More damage, please. I was 100% sure he's going to mention the air fryer. Air fryer is, is still goaded for some things, but you can make Brussels sprouts better in the pan than in an in a air fried component. I'm taking the damage, man. But I'll tell you, on Saturday, I made like a, a classic breakfast. Scrambled eggs, home fries, little toast. We didn't have any any breakfast meats, otherwise I would have been pogged. But uh, air fryer is like is a goaded home fry machine for sure. Instead of again either pan frying or roasting that shit takes a hundred years. <laughs> Put it in the air fryer. They're ready to go in like ten minutes. Dude, we are leveling like crazy. We don't have that many weapons. I'm gonna go fire wand increase. The cooldown scale decrease is, is mighty tempting, don't get me wrong. But I, I think we need some extra... I don't think that was a crown situation. Because I do feel like until we get uh, some kind of invulnerability, things are gonna get a touch spicy. We gotta get back to that chest somehow, man. I'm, I'm being brave with it. Shmoov me. Incredible shmoovment. Oh, ho, 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 man. Oh, that never goes out of style. You got to leave it a space. Okay, I could really use like a triple here. Just a triple. Come on, there they, there they go, there they go. You piece. Level two whip. Actually, like an insult. Oh! Dude, I'm telling you, this rune tracer is, is going hard right now. Okay, level 2 whip is actually dope. You're not wrong. What the heck is this, dude? Oh, it's a, a self-immolator. Oh, man. Hold on, hold on. Give me... Uh, make my fire wand better, and then please, please. What a ripoff, man. This is a joke. Level 3, whip! I sleep. Base damage up by 5. Like, I'm sure 5 is probably, like, you know, relatively significant, but it just seems like such an on uninspiring number five okay if you insist fires one more projectile why not i think i should be taking the rune tracer every time it shows up It's like Windrunner's Q ability. It's the defining trait of Imelda. Wait, what's her character name? Fran Fran Francesca? You guys watch the new season of Hype House on Netflix yet? Oh, I froze them all? More fire wand, please. Of course. I so I, I have not watched it and never will, but I I watched the little uh, the sizzle reel that plays when you like accidentally mouse over it on Netflix and I was I was laughing. 
because it was like uh, it, it it if it's it's real right like it's a real show but it feels like a send up of uh, influencer culture because there's like this uh, influencer is talking with her manager and her manager is like I rented out all that stuff you want like what are you looking for also I got like your stripper heels and they were going like tee hee and then the influencer's other manager called and was like. Hey, we got a real problem. Apparently you were at a party last night with Cody and you told Cody to come to the party even though you knew he was COVID positive. And I was like, oh man. It's such like a, it's like a self parody of influencer culture. We gotta try a duplicator, man. Weapons fire more projectiles. Okay, we also need to get a wall turkey at some point. My schmooving! Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, look at this. Look at this perfect line. I am gonna watch Righteous Gemstone Season 2 for sure. I, I already know what channel HBO is on my digital cable. I already know how to access their VOD products. I'm, uh, I just need to find the time. Wall Turkey! Luds, we're right back in this. Saved. You see in the size of these Brussels, man? Okay, there you go. Nice movement. You buy yourself a little window, and now we go. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay. Great time for a penta. A great time for a, a triple, followed by. Two more for a penta? Okay, okay, okay. Oh! <laughs> Three levels of whip. All right, well, it's still kind of sick, though. Okay, uh, all right, I've got to pick a side. Shmoove me. Look at that. Oh my god, look at the XP, though. I do think some movement would be helpful. The dopamine. Oh, 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 oh no, no! Okay, save, save, save. Okay, okay, okay. You know what? Give me a magic wand as well. Something that fires at the nearest enemy. Oh, I want that red rupee though, man. Oh, okay, okay. Give me a knife as well. Just like, let, let's get some more weaponry. We're pogging, man. So here's, now is the time. Maybe we're getting a little bit ahead of ourselves. But. Does the game ever end or is it literally just like survive as long as possible. Thirty minutes is is considered I don't know why I use considered like that. Thirty minutes is is a oh, win. Okay, okay. Another duplicator, okay. You see this spike ball? This is the speed run mindset. I can't believe we're only at 10 minutes. That's like where my brain's at right now. Okay. Just take a deep breath, maybe hydrate. And send it. At least triple me. Juice me. <laughs> Squeeze me. One more tease. Okay, 61. 61 gold. We got a lot of gold. We can, we can probably unlock the fourth char character after this run. We need like 90 more. No, we need two more. <laughs> oh, man. Give me that magic wand. I think because we have a triplicator, the more uh, projectiles we have, and the better those projectiles are, the happier we're going to be. Fires one more projectile. That being said, I'm actually I'm just gonna take a reduced cooldown on everything. Mm 
because then we're getting the triplication on our reverse, uh, our reduced cooldown. 8% is pretty big. Uh, doubles our, uh, our rate of fire in 9 iterations. You think I can divide by 72 in my head? Give me another one. I can't help but notice that the base enemy has become what used to be the strongest enemy. Hardly seems fair. I'm still schmoovin'. I know we need the XP, but I gotta I gotta live. What the heck is this? Oh! <laughs> And it's still coming. It's still coming. All right, give me one more projectile. Oh, you know what? Give me one more projectile and base damage up. Oh, <laughs> oh man. You know what? Let's take one armor. Why not? Could use it. See, we got a little turkey down there. Couldn't hurt. Look at that. Back to almost full HP. Oh, man. That was beautiful. So we gotta have some confidence here, because we have the whip, which means as long as we're moving on the same Y plane, I'm doing it not to the camera, as long as we do it on the Y plane, we're creating space for us. That's not X. X would be, can you see my mouse pointer on the screen? X would be if we stayed here and went up and down. We gotta stay on the same Y plane which is right here. Incorrect, no. You guys honestly need to go back to 10th grade mathematics. If I'm here, if I'm staying at this horizontal line, what is my Y value changing or is my Y value staying the same? It doesn't really matter. I can't help but notice that we've gone from NL's definitely wrong to, it doesn't matter who's right and who's wrong. Get blown out by a, a bachelor's degree in biology where I had to take exactly one semester of calculus and then also took one extra semester of biomath uh, a couple of years later and got like literally the worst grade I've ever received in my life. But anyway. Most of Chad is saying you're right anyway. I don't need most of chat. I require complete consensus. Rise is Y, run is X. When when you take an English major to math class. Sorry, that was a joke at your expense, but also it wasn't mean spirited, it was just it was just meant to be humorous. Bro, why are you using words to describe numbers? They're their own beautiful language. Okay, sorry. Fires one more projectile. I want this chest. I've isolated. The boss is now experiencing incredible pain. Give me the quintuple. He didn't even drop a chest. Okay, he gave me a red ruby, so I'm not upset, but still. What a rip. Oh, man. On the other hand. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, baby. Dude, the levels are not coming fast enough anymore. Give me more movement speed. More movement speed equals safer experience equals faster levels. Dude, we gotta get Dan on this. This is like his game. It's, it's pure dopamine. <laughs> we do have a... We got a Soyjack boss here. Let's go, okay. I'm ready. Okay. At least it's armor. That's something. Ooh. How about some extra fire wands? You gotta get to 30 minutes? I'll be honest, like I took 
fire wand because one of the comments I saw when I glanced said, please take fire wands, I beg you. So we've done that now. I honestly think the whip is very important to us. There's an orb on the right. Okay, orb on the right. I also saw there was a lot of gold there. Let's go to that orb on the right. I don't see it. <laughs> a little scared. You know what? Reduce my cooldowns again. It's further. Okay, I believe. I see another boss. He's getting whipped. He's getting whipped to all of, all high hell. Come on, man. You, you don't have the sauce. Or me. Oh, let's go. Okay, let's keep that fire wand moving. Oh, man. Let's whip. Let's get some extra. Oh, base speed up 20? Let's let's take the fire wand. Oh, oh, oh man. Oh. What a game. What a game. They they studied like the primate brain in order to implement systems in this game. Fires one more projectile. Okay, don't mind if I do. I'm invincible. Like I mean, that's, like, huge amounts of hubris. I wonder if they have a difficulty spike at 15 minutes for the midpoint of a run. I think, like, I love that, like, the game looks so complicated, but literally it's, like, the simplest... Oh, the Demogorgon! It's the simplest game of all time. Like, all you do is move. Forehead. But it looks so impressive. <laughs> yeah, the, the shooting happens automatically. I mean, some of the stuff, it shoots in the direction you're facing, so you might want to, like, try to aim it, but I don't know. I, I have a, it, you, it might influence your movement, let's put it that way. Trying to aim it might be a bit of a, a misnomer. A turkey? We don't need that turkey yet. Just leave it for a second. Reduce my cooldowns by 8%. I can't believe that boss is still alive. Oh, never mind. <laughs> really? Because I'm looking at the drop tables and it seems like at the drop tables, we should have had at least a triple by now. Why? I don't know why they're screwing us so hard. Someone said there was a purple bag over here. Okay, hold on, hold on. I mean, anytime I see fire one projectile, I take it. Fires one more projectile, I take it. Someone said purple bag, purple bag, purple bag. You just got it? All right, never mind. <laughs> I knew that is what I meant to say. Yo, we killed uh, 11,000 enemies. It's like an Isaac run where you go to Ubermom. You know what? Let's take a little XP gain. I know, you know, the, the earlier you get it, the better, but we still got half the run left. I'm still a believer it could be useful. We're pogging up so hard, we might as well uh, invest in ourselves. Want the turkey? Oh man! Even the ghost don't frighten me. Okay, we gotta choose a side. Anytime you see uh, the walls closing in on you, that's your cue to get your whip involved. You gotta move left, right. You gotta stay at a consistent Y value, and you gotta make yourself some space. And then you make yourself some space. Sometimes you're gonna have to bail out of that, and that's okay. Fires one more projectile, huh? You're gonna make yourself some space. Are you seeing this bird? Holy cow, man. When it goes, it goes. Okay, now we, we've created an escape route. Now we get out. Beautiful place. Beautiful place. 
Oh, baby. Oh, <laughs> oh, I, I don't even want to think about what this is going to look like when we get our next orb. I love that the orb seems to be like once every like 15 minutes. That's a, that's a very smart design choice. Oh man, can't believe the bit rate's holding up. Yeah, even on the Steam store page, it doesn't look uh, right. Like, it looks fuzzy. It looks like Forza. Fires one more projectile. You shouldn't have. All right, I see a large witch here. Either that or it's like Marty McFly playing an electric guitar at the Sadie Hawkins dance. This means you're going to drop a penta for me. I know it. I know it to be true. That's why I'm focusing you. We're due. Look at the loot, man. <laughs> look at the loot and look at the bird. Oh, fires one more projectile. Pretty sick. I'm not doing it. Like, there's no horde. They're just melting. Please. Please. Good start. Okay. I'll take three. I'll take three is fine. Three is fine. I love getting the crown without having to give up a level choice for it. Like, that just feels good. We take those. She gain on my XP till I level? That's pretty true when you think about it. 13,000 kills. I bet the way scaling works in this game, I bet we get to 30,000 if we live for another 10 minutes. I'm gonna be honest, I feel like this, these are the worst choices we've had. I'm gonna take a little crown. The dove is actually like, it's the main character. It doesn't always have the best target selection. Okay, we have an incredibly large, that's a darkest dungeon enemy. I'm not scared. This is, we, we, for a while we've been on autopilot, now we use our power movement. Fires one more projectile. We were, we were coasting for a bit, now we gotta start playing the real game again. They coming out the damn walls. <laughs> okay. Whip, 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 whip. I'm not scared of skulls. Dude, the whip lets us go. Passes through one more enemy, sure. The whip lets us go left, right. The knife lets us go up, down. We got the we got the whole Cartesian plane in the palm of our hands right now. Oh, oh man. <laughs> Red rupee? Not quite. It's not quite enough. Dude, we're almost level 50. And the best part is we get another chest after this. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, we got some pinks and some purples. Let's still take those. A little fire wand, a little magic wand, a little knife. Sure, why not? Why not? Still, it still seems pretty good to me. Give me a magic wand now. We, we, we leveled our knife enough. No fear. Just 100% confidence. 
It's like popping on a high visibility vest and walking onto a construction site. Like, as long as you don't stop, nobody's gonna stop you. Give me one more projectile. I'm... I am pondering the orb. If I, if I could get an orb, I would love to ponder it right now. What do you got for it? You're gonna drop something. You're gonna drop something. Is it gonna be an orb? It's not an orb, it's a chest. Hold on, we just gotta make some space. Thank you. I almost gave the camera the finger. What the heck is that? Tell me. Hellfire, evolved fire wand, passes through enemies, requires spinach. Do I... I have spinach! Whoa! <laughs> and to think I was upset we only got one thing. Dude, this is legit like walking on the sidewalk when you have a, when you have a stroller. Like... Take an extra magic wand. Like, people just get out of your way. Like, I don't even... Look at the, the crits, man. Are you seeing these crits? I don't, okay, you know what? That It got a little spicy in there. I, I don't even want to know how much XP I'm leaving on the table over here. Okay, don't don't get don't get insane here. You know what? Let's get some armor just in case. I took I took some damage, a little hubris. It's hard to tell where the enemies uh, end and my projectiles begin sometimes. So is this just an idle game you play actively? Yeah, it's a game, I would say. I would describe it as a video game for sure. Red bag? Where? Where? Loot hero. Great name. Red bag. Red bag. Red sack on the right. Let's get some armor. I think we're 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 ready, man. Red sack, red sack. Ray, I see it. I think it's just money, unfortunately, but still. Ten. That was for ten gold. I thought it would at least be like fifty. Another wall chicken. <laughs> oh my god. My frames. <laughs> We're out of upgrades, man. It's all right. These guys will be dead soon. We'll be fine. Holy cow. Yeah, this is what super people looks like when you're just inside of an empty building. I think we got all the levels. They're not even giving us options anymore. Where's my orb? So true. All right. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I, I can't even follow what's happening anymore. There's like a, a One Piece cosplayer here now. I'll just, if I had wings, I would fly. Let me contemplate. I glance in the cut and I see my homie Nate. I gotta be honest. There's, I, I got a little bit of input delay now. It's like every every action I input 
takes like a third of a second to actually manifest on the screen. I'll take a big coin bag. They got nothing left for us. Is Are we in final boss territory, by the way? Is that what's happening here? <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> there we go. There we go. We got some speed back. Okay, I'll take. I'll just take thirty health points. I don't know what I, we we must have killed enough enemies to actually like get some frames. Uh, it's oh, we killed the big boss. I think one chest. What a rip. What a rip. Oh my god, are you seeing the XP though? Oh, it was an evolved magic wand. I didn't read because it didn't have like a flaming skull or anything. Oh man, to the victor go the spoils. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay. We've actually, like, cleansed the library. All it took was killing 20,000 enemies. 20 coins! It evolved money bag. Well, we got three minutes left. I did see a comment, I saw, uh, oh, here we go again. I'm, I'm schmoovin' too fast, man. Uh, it's, it said, NL, I love watching you play Variety, but this is just giving me a headache. I hear ya. Um, is there anything specifically about it you think that's, that's causing the issue? <laughs> I understand. It's, I'm, I'm not offended. I promise. I'm just gonna like stand still for a bit. How's the CPU handling it? Is a chest? There is a chest. Someone's an orb. Oh my god, this might save our frames. I just gotta be careful because I move so fast. I think I could like die before I even realize what's happening. Frame saved? Just in case, man, just in case. It's just gonna give me a bunch of money. Don't lie to me. Look at that, yeah, three evolved money bags. I guess on the bright side, think of all the passive unlocks we're about to get. Probably two. I suppose that's pretty true. Minute and a half. Minute and a half. Remember, yeah, when we said it was an idle game that you actually play? <laughs> Two more minutes till final boss? What do you- this isn't the final boss? This is the only time we get our frames back. Ah, you piece! Oh, coin bag, huh? A little surprising. You said three minutes, two minutes ago? Yeah, my timer's not moving at one second equals one second. That's old meta. Oh, 
<laughs> we got a, we got a little time dilation happening right now. Look at all the levels we're getting, though, man. This is crazy. <laughs> Get out of here! I'm taking damage, man! I'm going down! I'm going down! 30 seconds, okay, just, just hold on! <laughs> Check settings, maybe there's something to help. I don't think you were here at the start of the stream. Just hold. Just hold. We're just, we're just doing loops. We're going up and down. Ten seconds. I don't think we're going to lose, though. Like, I... I don't think enemies are getting much closer to us. There's a chest. Oh! What the heck? Oh, stage completed. Okay, I literally thought that we just got like one tapped because we had to press the space bar or something like that. I was so upset. <laughs> oh my God. Stage completed though. Let's go. Holy cow. Our bird did 305,000 damage. I'm just going to be honest with you. I had no idea our holy wand did a lot of damage. Oh, uh, Rune Tracer did 1.4 million damage. Hellfire did 2 million damage. DPS 4.2 thousand. Holy cow. All right, that was pretty sick. Let's power up. We have 3,000 coins. I would say second level magnet. So you get more experience. Definitely seems valuable. You know what? Yeah, luck. So you get more selections. This seems like a good... Oh, well, coins as well. Oh, a mount. Fires one more projectile from all weapons. Duration. Okay, let, let's go luck. Why not? Take me back. It's a little expensive, though. Okay. I'm just going to throw in a slash marker. Vampire survivors. And I'm going to...